Hello there. Welcome to the Pit of Tensions. We are going to pick up from where we left off with Life is Strange Episode 5, the final episode, Polarized. We now, what the hell is this place? If only David would fucking shut up. <laughs> we, he saved us, though. He saved us. We need to appreciate that. Sorry, David. Uh, it was quite an intense first uh, part of Episode 5, I would say. We woke up in the room and so on, and we jumped through... I had no idea he was this sick. We jumped through multiple timelines before we eventually find ourselves back in the room again where then surprise surprise david saved us thank god not sure how maybe we can find out but anyway here we go let's pick up let's continue With prescott's head david are you okay look at this place it feels like hell jefferson was was going to kill me like he did to Victoria Chase. Oh, no. I always suspected that son of a bitch. I never did. I Why never would you did. be an ass by saying he suspected Until everybody? Tonight. You shouldn't have to suspect your teacher. He wasn't a real teacher. He just wanted to lecture. It was part of his sick plans. I wasn't surprised when you accused Nathan of drugging Kate Marsh. I thought so, too. And Max, I treated Kate like shit. I know she's a good person, but I'm not. I hope I get to tell her that soon. Oh, David. Me too. Me too. I think that would make her very happy. I knew Nathan Prescott was a threat. I just waited too long to neutralize him. Jefferson already did. They had some weird father-son thing going on. But Nathan killed Rachel, and Jefferson had to use him as a scapegoat. That pervert was pulling all this shit right under my nose, too. I could have stopped him and Nathan if only... I wasn't so stupid. No. I told Principal Wells Nathan had a gun, and I almost used it. But he didn't want to believe me. I should have been more loud. We all make decisions we regret. But I have to admit, I'm impressed by you. And Chloe. And your investigation. I had all the high-tech toys while you had each other. She learned from you. Maybe she learned from you. I think she only learned how to hate my guts. You both had a tough start. And I know it wasn't easy. I'm not going to make any excuses for my behavior. I tried to be a good soldier, but I wasn't so great. I tried to be a good father, too, but when Joyce kicked me out, I had nothing. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry about that. I didn't want that to happen. I should never have set up those surveillance cams or kept all those files. I'm going to tell Joyce I was wrong about you. She does love you. It's pretty obvious. I try not to use my service as an excuse, but it's hard to come home after war. Yeah. Most people don't know or care what it's like. Except Joyce. She gave me hope. A new life. And you saved mine. Chloe, is she she would be proud of you. I just want to see her safe with her mother. I promised Joyce I would go see a family counselor. And I'll start by apologizing to Chloe. I don't expect her to call me dad, but maybe she'll stop calling me step douche. Speaking of Chloe... So, where is Chloe? Thank you, David. Uh... Why would I hide the truth? Tell the truth. David, uh, Chloe is, is dead. This isn't happening. He can't. No, God. Not Chloe. Max, are you are you sure? Are you? Yes, I. I saw her. I. I saw. Him. Jefferson Killer in the junkyard last night. 
last night when I was feeling sorry for myself in my hotel room. Oh, Shannon, this is a bad I choice. I promised Joyce that I would protect her and Chloe. How can I face her and explain this? I never even told Chloe that I... I God damn it! Please don't kill You killed my wife's child, you sick fucker! And you took away my stepdaughter! Uh, kick him in the head, just once. But don't, don't, don't kill him! David, wait! Rewind. Rewind. Should we rewind? <laughs> Shit, David. Max, I'm sorry. I'm sorry you had to see that. Good riddance, but David, no. What a mess. What have I done? All that time I wasted with surveillance. I... Chloe, I'm sorry. Joyce, I failed you. My family. You didn't fail. You did your best. Fucking rewind. Max, you better get outside. You've seen enough of this room. David, thank you for saving me. Okay, my god, they, they're really not pulling back on the last episode. Holy shit. I'd like to rewind, please. I don't think this is necessary. Hello? Rewind. Fucking rewind. There you go. I've been pressing the wrong button. Go, 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 go. Because we're saving Chloe anyway, so... It's not necessary. <laughs> okay. Max, I'm sorry you had to be here. I didn't... Okay. First error. Haha. Uh -huh. Jefferson looks so pathetic now. Damn right it is. he is. Camera. All this expensive gear just for... Sick bullshit. I can still feel those straps. Uh, Stop, Max. I had no idea You're free. I, this sick. Oh, I want to burn all these photos. Oh my god. I hate looking at me uh, like that. Okay, no, no, fuck off. Oh, shit. I, I hate that. Why did I do that? Okay, second error. God damn it. Should be a drinking game. If I, if I were to live stream. Jefferson torched everything. Now the only photo I can get is the one Warren took. Mm -hmm. Oh. That's Victoria's bracelet. Uh, I bet Jefferson was going to use... Just looking at that makes me want to vomit. I mean, he, he killed Nathan already. He's gonna frame it like, oh, it's, you know, suicide and all that. Feeling guilty and shit. No more fucking guns. God. Yeah, good God. Every Jesus. song you hear in jail will be torture. Frank isn't a bad person, but he can't be in denial about the drugs he provided. Oh, Chloe. I'm gonna save you. For the last that, time. That dude has no been collecting... Us. Wait, take. There's no way I'm leaving your necklace here. Oh, okay, interesting. We can take the necklace. Are we gonna end up with two necklaces? <laughs> okay, no time for joke. No idea he was this sick. All right, let's talk to David. Only at this time, let's not. You know. So gross. Let's lie to him this time. I wonder if he charged that dumb. For Jeff. Oh, I always just. I never. You should. He was. I was. And Max. Me too. 
I knew... Jefferson... That pervert was... No. We all make the... We... We are a great team. Let's change it a bit. That's Here. one of my problems. I'm not good at teamwork. Never was. But you were in the army, dude. Even in the service. Okay, even in the I service. I can't even imagine what you went through. I'm not going to make any excuses. Yeah, skip. I tried to be a good father. Uh huh. I'm sorry. I'm. S I shouldn't. I'm going to. I try not. And you saved. I just want to see. So where it? Okay, hide the truth. Okay, just hide the truth, man. David, um, she was pretty stressed out, so, um, she went to go, um, medicate before I ended up in here. So, she's okay. Oh, thank God. Yeah, I think this is better. <laughs> Once I'm happy, Chloe's a stoner. <laughs> David, I, I have to go outside and get some real air. And use my phone. Of course. Go on. All right, time to save Chloe. You're a brave soldier. I'm glad Chloe has a best friend like you. Ooh. Go on now. You've seen enough of this room. Thank you, David. I'm sorry I had to lie to you. Okay, teacher. Let's see what kind of photo evidence you shit all over this computer. All right. Jefferson will end up in jail. Not for long. At least I don't think so. There are parts of this that I don't really know, honestly. Freedom! Freedom! Holy shit! This storm is real. I need to find a way. Since when you got yes. that jacket? Was that like the the Warren, other way around of your you jacket or something? <sighs> Never mind. Listen, do you have that photo you took last night in the parking lot? Yeah, but why? It wasn't that great a shot. Yes, it is, and I, I want it. Where are you? I'm at the Two Wells Diner. Pretty much trapped in here with Joyce thanks to this Armageddon weather. I'm expecting the ocean to turn red. I'm on my way. Come it's on, not that's that crazy. Armageddon. You can barely walk on the sidewalk outside. Seriously, Max, stay wherever you are. That's okay. Me too. But it's not over yet, Warren. So hold on. Okay. Are we gonna use the car? We're gonna use the car. Right, we're gonna use the car. A pretty nice car. I think this is Nathan's car, right? Yeah. <laughs> Turns out it has that, what is it, a 2012 movie? Decopolis movie where you need like voice recognition to start, you know, with the Russian mafia engine start, you know. <laughs> Find that to be really funny. That scene. I told you, I trust Limbo have been warning you people for years that our culture of sin and entitlement would lead to God striking us down. Here we go. And I'm the one trapped in this fucking radio station. Somebody get me the hell out of here now! <laughs> now, God damn it, how well, unfortunately, Frank Underwood has sucked the FEMA funds dry. Sorry, <laughs> pop culture reference. <laughs> you have one new message. <laughs> Spoiler, message I guess. Minor one. At 9 p.m. Max, it's, it's Nathan. I, I just wanted to say... Nathan. I'm sorry. I didn't want to hurt Kate or Rachel or... or I didn't want to hurt anybody. Everybody... Use me! <laughs> Mr. Jefferson, it's coming for me now. All this shit will be over soon. Watch out, Max. He wants to hurt you next. Damn. I'm sorry. Whew. Okay. Wait, is this song copyrighted? Oh my god, please don't tell me that it is. I, I'm just, I'm, just, I've gotta be so fucking pissed if it is. It's a very short one, right? It's a very short song. I'm trying to speak as loud as I can. Wait, you crashed the car? Oh wait, it's not the same car. Maybe I'll just mute it from this point. Yeah. 
just to be safe since there's no dialogue like as soon as nathan's uh voice message was over I can just cut it there cut the song there cool cool song though just make sure to mention the title very climactic so to say even though this is not necessarily the end but i guess it'll work That's an insanely huge tornado. And why are people's voices echoing? That doesn't really make any sense. Hurry up. Okay, wait. Hi, hi. That guy is trapped. I have to get this guy. Help! Okay, help. Thanks, kid. You okay? Once what does I it look like, here, Max? I've been hauling loads for way too long in this shithole town. Okay. Better go now. Way to go, Max. I ain't never coming back. You need a lift? No thanks. I have to find a You friend. do need a you lift, go, though. Girl. You go. Okay. Love the fact that she's wearing the necklace, by the way. Nice touch. Okay, be careful now. Hi, you okay there? Alyssa needs help again. Help me get down, Max! Hi. What am I supposed to do, Alyssa, though? Are you okay? Let me help you down. Yes, yes please, Max. I don't want to die like this. Don't worry, don't worry. Uh, fuck. Okay, what are we supposed to do? I'm well aware. Oh wait, why is there some? Help me get down, Max. Help me. Yes, yes. Please help me get down. Okay, it won't help if you keep screaming like that. Okay, please shut the fuck up. I try to solve things. Oh, wait, fuck. Evan! Watch out! This my master Help. Be. Evan, do you see that tornado? Get the hell out of here! Max, there's no way I can pass up these images. Just look at it! You can't take a picture when you're dead. Now move your ass. Okay, if you insist. Whoa, Max! You do know things. You're such an idiot. I'm pretty sure that's Only a different voice o voice actor. <laughs> okay? Now I better listen to the real everyday hero. It sounds hero. different. Come with me. I have to help somebody else first. Okay, so we saved Evan. Cool. Now how do we help her? Okay, let's see. There's got to be a way. No, I, no time. I can't think about all those children out there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Shit. Melissa needs help again. Is there a way? Oh, plank! Oh my god. Okay, use. Didn't see that. I'm sorry. Why was I screaming? Come on, Alyssa. Take my hand. Take my hand. Da 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 paradise. You did it, Max. Are you okay? Now I am. We need to get out of here. Alyssa, you go on. I have to help other people. Watch out, Max. Damn. That was close. <laughs> Thank you, Alyssa. Now we're even. Be careful out there. Aw. All right. That's a cool way to wrap things around. Okay, so I hear other people asking for help over here. 
Is it you? Okay, hi. Oh shit. Oh, I can't stand seeing his body. Well, I mean, he's dead. I don't think there's anything that I can do for that person. Sorry, whoever you are. No, I can't cross this way. Is there another way around? Well, there is an entrance here, so says the clue. How can I get out of here? Chill, Max, chill. If we can make it out of this, Chloe. <laughs> Not the right time to be thinking about that, Max. What's this? Okay. Oh, shit. He's dead. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> dude. Dude, dude. I want to help that fisherman, but he's in shock and he might not hear me. Yeah, and electrocuting him might Damn. not. I'm stuck here unless I put out this fire first. Okay, okay, there has to be a way. No? Uh, this makes me so sad. There has to be a way to save that fisherman. There has to be a way where I don't have to electro uh, electrocute him. Look, okay. okay. I just need to switch on the electricity to activate the sprinkler. What am I supposed to do? Okay, no more. Am I supposed to wait until I can actually speak to him? Yo, dude, move! Don't fail me, Fusebox. No, it won't, but that's not the problem. Anything, anything. Come on, anything. Anything that I can use. Is he just gonna die? Is that it, really? Oh, I know. We need to turn that thing off and then go inside and then rewind time. Sorry, I forgot we can do teleportation with this time mechanics. Hi, what's up? Come on, you have to get out of here right now. I need to breathe. Uh, I need air. That's why you need to get outside. Ah, <sighs> oh, this can't be the end. Don't worry, my dude. It's not. This can't be the end. This can't be the end. And then we get electrocuted. Get out of here. <laughs> the whole town is dying. Okay. I better hurry to the diner over there. I need Warren's photo. Let's go. The sound is fine, right? Yeah, should be fine. I mean, if, it, if the storm is way too loud, then I can just tune it down a bit. Take it down a notch. Dial it down, so to say. Alright, can we move? Cool. Woo! Insane! Whoa! What the fuck was that? We. Is there something that we can do to prevent that? Or are we just supposed to keep rewinding? Uh crap. Kablooey. Nope. I mean, I haven't done anything anyway, so... What I could do is just keep walking. Oh, there's the door. Wait. 
no need to go there now. <laughs> so we can't get inside unless we stop the explosion. And how the fuck are we supposed to do that? <laughs> well, I need to stop that, right? How, how? Come on, Max. Stop that fire. No, stop that fire? Oh. Jesus. Okay, didn't see you. Okay, how, how, how do I do this? Uh. Okay, sorry, 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 sorry. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, kablooey. Okay, is there a way to get over there? Should be right. Okay, give me a sec, okay? Sand? Really? Unbelievable. Yes. Okay, that took way longer than I thought. The monsters are actually the people here. All right, whatever. No need for you to get all high and mighty right now. Oh, where's the homeless person? Oh, she's not here. I hope she's in a shelter. I hope so too. I never even asked her name. Not all my Once rant again, would have been this for naught. This is not a test. An E6 tornado warning has been issued for Arcadia Bay and surrounding county. Go get him, Julia. Blackwell bullying, cool. The emergency broadcast system is now in effect. At least nobody's going to starve in here. Right. Max. <laughs> Still with the black eye. And Frank is. Frank is here. Oh yeah, he, he's alive. He's not dead. <laughs> oh, Jesus, I am so glad to see you, sweetie. Are you okay? Yes. What about you guys? Two whales is barely standing now. It nearly exploded. I, know, <laughs> I can tell you that. Tornado. Oh, poor Officer Barry and all those people out there. I know. There. Okay, get your ass inside. I have to get back to this gentleman on the ground. Lauren has been gathering all the first aid. It's not much, Joyce, but it's all we have. You okay, Warren? How the hell did I ignore all those warnings, Max? The snow? The eclipse? There's nothing you could do about it, Warren. I'm so stupid. Should have seen it coming. I mean, there's... I, I doubt there's anything that you can do. No, everybody is safe here. But I need that photo from Warren to help Chloe. Sorry. Hi, Frank. Okay, What's up? Max. Excuse me while I go help this other gentleman. Frank, I'm so glad you're here. How are you okay? Stay away from me, you what? bitch. <laughs> Besides this tornado, the hole <laughs> in, in my leg. leg. Not to mention the <laughs> fact that I might die on the floor of a diner, and you're the last person I could see. You know what? I'm cool. Jesus. And I bet that thief Chloe and you didn't find Rachel, right? Rachel is dead. Ha! Oh, Frank. Sorry, that's rude. I don't know how to say this, so I just will. Rachel is dead. Fuck you, Max. No. No way. She left town. She's gone. Now, how do you know, huh? How? All of our clues led us to my professor, Mark Jefferson. He had this creepy photo torture chamber, and we found out he was using Nathan Prescott to drug and photograph Blackwell students. Prescott? Fuck! Fuck, I knew it! I should never have hooked up with that sick punk! Pompidou hated him! Yeah. You saw... You saw Rachel. Yes. Yes. I wish I did it. I'm so, so sorry, Frank. Nathan wanted to impress Jefferson, and he, he killed her. How? Hmm. How did he kill her? Overdose. He used some drug and gave her an overdose. Oh, no, now he's going to feel overdose. guilty about it. 
The only way oh. Nathan could have done that is if, is if I sold it to him. I killed my lioness. No. What have I done? Okay, rewind. Where is this motherfucker rewind. Jefferson? He's going to jail. He won't be hurting anybody anymore. Rachel. Oh, God. She was the one good thing in my life, Max. I know she was too young. I expect her to leave me. Just, just not how it happened. I would never have stopped her from going after her dreams. I know. I know. She obviously cared about you, Frank. No, Rachel cared about a lot of people. Especially Chloe. But, uh... Now I see why Rachel dug her. And Chloe was man enough to ask me for help after all that shit we went through. Chloe would appreciate that. You know, the one time I met my dad, the bastard quoted the Bible and said he wanted to enter his house justified. In other words, to do the right thing. Me too. And maybe you're helping me get there, Max. Don't get me wrong, kid. I still think you're weird. But you're cool. I'm sorry, Frank. My condolences. Max, do you... Do you think this is the end? Alright, let's speak to Joyce. On, Max. Let's talk over here and give Frank some rest and space. He could use one after what I've told him. Sorry, Frank. Joyce, how are you doing? Just when I think I've already been through the ringer. Where's Chloe? I'll find her. I... I'll find her. Not in this storm, you won't. And you're not going out there, Max. I just have to pray that Chloe and David hold up somebody safe. I'm sorry about all this, Joyce. Don't be, honey. It's not like you whipped up this tornado on your own. Whoa! <laughs> I mean, I'm also sorry about everything with David. You don't have control over any of that. David is an adult, and he has a lot more age and experience under his belt. And if he doesn't always show it. <laughs> okay, let's be... be <laughs> let's grandstand a bit. Perfect storm. I know. I just feel like everything that's going on with us is the perfect storm for Arcadia Bay. I just want our lives to be normal again. With all the shit going on this week, I think you're right. And look at me, trying to keep my family together. Again. Max, did I make a mistake kicking David out? What should I say here? Oh god, uh, that's your choice. Um, David needs you. David saved my life from the storm. I saw how much he cares about Chloe, even if he couldn't show it. David needs you more than ever, and I can see why you love him. I'm so happy David was there for you. He has a lot of weight on his back from the war, but he truly wants to help people. He even agreed to take a family counseling class. I'm sure that was a hard thing for him to do. It shows how much he truly cares about you and Chloe. Nothing would make me happier than for David and Chloe to make peace, not war. I don't know what to do anymore. I just... I just want this storm to blow over forever. Maybe it's time we leave Arcadia Bay. If we can. David is a real hero, Joyce. I know that all he wants to do is make you happy. I know he would do anything for you. And Chloe. I know. And yes, he's not William, but that's okay. He's not supposed to be. You reminded me of when he came into my life. I was ready to give up. David's love gave me strength. He even told me I was his hero. And I can't give up loving him. I want him to come back home. Oh, I hope I get to tell him that soon. <sighs> Please be okay, Chloe. I can't lose you. 
All right, I guess that's enough dilly dally now, isn't it? No, I will not sit. <laughs> oh, there's Pompidou. Frank still has Pompidou. Thank God he didn't get run over, or he didn't get shot by Chloe. Yeah, I think we did good. <laughs> we did good by Pompidou. First aid. Can I use some? Could you use some? I think. Hi. All right, speak. I hate to say I'm glad to see you, but I'm so glad to see you. That's okay. The important thing is that you're safe. And I know you can take care of yourself after Nathan. You should have done that a long time ago. But damn, Max. I can't believe you actually drove down here in the middle of a fucking E6 tornado. Just for one photograph? I mean, I know you didn't come for me. Warren, I came for all of you. Just tell me you do have the photograph. I just want... Now shut up and listen. Oh, yeah. You're finally going to tell me what you never did in the parking lot. Oh, no. I wish I would have. So I'm just going to tell you without any explanation. Trust me, okay? I always do. You should probably tell me quick. I had a vision in Jefferson's class of a tornado destroying Arcadia Bay. I went to the bathroom and saw my best friend Chloe get shot by Nathan Prescott. You with me so far? Where else could I be? <laughs> Go on. Okay. Then I found out that I could rewind time. And long story short, Mark Jefferson is insane and dangerous. Whoa. Is that all? He killed Chloe. I have to go back in time. Jefferson already k killed Chloe. I can't let that happen. I have to do something, Warren. Max, going back in time is what caused the storm. Uh -huh. All because, because of me? How? I'm not a real scientist, even though I play one at school, but this seems like pure cause and effect. Maybe chaos theory. What happened with Jefferson? Did, did he hurt you? He dosed me. He used Nathan to get Why would you say Rachel was killed? But, uh, Jefferson tied me up and dosed me with some drug and took sick photos of me. It was so horrible. Max, I'm so sorry. They forgot to, to animate the mouth. That. You're the bravest person I've ever known. You know, I want to kill that son of a bitch. Where is he? Busted. History. Which I need to change fast to make it right again. Is that bad? For every action, there's there's a reaction. Whenever you reverse or, or alter time, maybe you cause a chain reaction. Even in the environment. Um, more time together? You believe me? Either one between the two. More time together, let's, let's say Warren, that. I know this all sounds insane, but you're the only other person who I can count on now. I wish we had more time together. Do you believe me? Max, of course I believe you. You're the most amazing person I've ever met. And I'm glad you trust me. Always. I just wish I could trust my powers. I guess we'll never know if it's magic or science. Even if it's from a wizard or a wormhole, you're part of something bigger. Now, I don't believe in fate or destiny, but after this week, I realize I don't know shit. That makes both of us, Warren. I do know you're here for a reason. And I guess it's up to you to find out why. Max, I'm sorry you got stuck in this. In this, I don't have a fucking clue what's going on. But I have total faith that you'll do the right thing when the time comes. I'm so proud of you, Max. When the time there be comes. More important moment in history. And I'm in the middle of it with you. So thank you for trusting me. Thanks for being here. Always. I thought that we can kiss him. Oh well. Alright, let's focus on a photo. Hey. Be careful out there. 
Ah. Uh. <laughs> oh god. Um uh, um I mean ooh. I'm sorry. I'm a Max Chloe shipper, but uh, um Hug him. I mean, I don't think Max's head is there yet, so heart is there yet, so hug. Let's give him a good old hug. I could use a hug before I do this. Me too. That's sweet, right? Yeah, that's sweet. Yeah, I think this is actually better. Better go before. I get pathetic and tell you not to. <laughs> You're not pathetic. You're one of my heroes. And I'm going to make the right choices from now on. I swear. That's why you're super max. Mad Max. <laughs> I hope I'm not the only one Please who okay, finds hugs to be I more comforting compared to kisses. I mean, yeah. Uh, I guess it makes sense. It's just that... about the drive to lock. No, shut up, Frank. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Another time jump. A little foreshadowing, by the way. Make the right decision at the right time. So. Got no time for this shit. Come on, Max. <sighs> Chloe. Jesus, dude, what is up with you? I'm just glad we're here together. I guess you need to talk. No worries. It's all good. I'm glad you're with me too. What's going on, Max? We have to find Nathan right now. He's gonna Sorry, we were in. It to Rachel. Let's go. Now. Chloe, wait, listen. I can <clears throat> walk and listen, okay? Stop and listen for once. Fine, Max. I'm listening. Chloe, you can't go in that party. You're going to... You're gonna die if you do. You used your powers, right? And you fucked around with time and I died. Not like that. You're supposed to back me up. So there's no way that punk ass bitch Nathan Prescott is taking me it's down. Not You're Nathan. right, he won't. Mark Jefferson killed you. And others. Jefferson, the art teacher? That's bullshit. Nathan is the fucking serial killer. We saw the proof. Now, excuse me, I'm going to that party to make sure he never hurts anybody again. Are you coming? Chloe. Nathan is dead. Nathan is dead. And you're in danger. That fucker is already dead? How do you know that? Because I was there. Will you please tell me exactly what happened? Please. Okay, glad that stopped her. Um, Jefferson hurt me. Chloe. Jefferson drugged and kidnapped me. I was tied up in his bunker. You have no idea what hell I went through to get back here. But I couldn't let you die. You brought me back here and I can't lose you again. I won't. Um, Max, I'm, I'm so sorry. I was the one who dragged you into all this shit. Nobody, especially you, should have to go through that. I... Now we have to stop Jefferson. With one bullet. No, not this way. Chloe, I, I can't keep fixing everything if all I'm gonna do is just break it over and over again. I know how this is gonna turn out, and I'm afraid I'm fucking up all these alternate realities. Wait, alternate realities? What do you mean, Max? What did you do? No. I fucked up. I fucked up, Chloe. I wanted to make things right, but everything turned out wrong. Max, what the hell are you talking about? Back in time, just... I, I was able to go back in time. Why would you talk about the last that? William was alive. I stopped him from leaving, but... But you ended up in a car crash instead. You saw my dad again? You... You were completely... Oh, mad. okay. And... You, you were in pain. You were slowly dying, and you you asked me to end your life. I did. 
for you. I, I didn't want you to suffer in any other timeline or reality. I, I couldn't bear the thought of you in any more pain. God, Max. That must have been... That must have been awful for you. I, I'm so sorry I had to ask you that. It was worse for you. But I had no idea what would happen, and as usual, I messed everything up, and... I never want to hurt you. Ever. You have to believe me. Of course I do. Do you think I would even know how to handle that situation? Nobody would. The important thing is that we're together again. You're right. That's, that's why you should come with me, so we can stay together and stay alive. I hear you, Max, but do you think we should let Jefferson get away with torture and murder? Of course not. If we tell David, he'll believe us and he can actually stop him. Right? I don't get it. Why do you trust him after you totally reamed him the other day? He saved He's not even me. at our house anymore. David saved me. Chloe, David saved me from Jefferson. If he didn't track down the dark room, I'd be dead right now. Max, I had no clue. I should have been the one to save you, but I'm so grateful David was there. So what's your plan? We tell him everything, including that Victoria is in danger. Okay. You've been there so much. I, I believe you, Max. After all, I'm still your faithful companion. Glad it turned yes, out for the better. So listen, in a few minutes, I won't know any of this happened. Nothing. We absolutely have to stay in your room and do nothing. Then we explain everything to David, and we finally let him do his job. You'll have to tell me exactly what I did and said just now. Just explain that I traveled through time using the photo. Will you believe me? I'll always believe you, Chloe. Okay, let's see what timeline we end up with. So Chloe won't die. You explain it to David. David's gonna come with the police force. Cool, cool. Cool vest, by the way. And... Ah. Ah. Oh, Chloe! I see that the real Max is back. So, how was your time trip, dude? Shut up. Oh, you're alive. You're alive. Oh, both of us. I did so much to bring you back, Chloe. It worked. It actually worked. You're with me again. Looks like even fate doesn't want us apart. And I traveled through multiple realities just to save my ungrateful ass over and over. And I hope it was worth it. But I don't blame you for wanting me out of your life after all my drama. Come on. I'm the official drama king and queen of Arcadia Bay this week. Just look at what my powers have caused in just a short time. Nobody. You're Max fucking Caulfield, time warrior. Even if you weren't, you're kind and caring. Nobody could have a better best friend. Nobody. You didn't ask for any of this to happen, but it did. You need to accept how awesome you are. Maybe I willed it subconsciously or something. I always wanted my life to be special and adventure. But not without you. And it, it didn't happen until I moved back here. So without you, my powers wouldn't even exist. Then for whatever scientific, mystical reason that we'll obviously never figure out, we were meant to be together at this exact moment in history. I have to think that Rachel was somewhere behind the scenes, fighting for justice. I'd like to think that too. We all owe Rachel Amber. Now tell me everything that happened. You you remember, right? Well, we we left the party and made sure Jefferson couldn't find us. For once, I was glad I lived in an actual fortress. Then the storm got hella crazy, and, and you said we would be safe at the lighthouse. Chloe, look. The storm is getting bigger now. Why would we, we be safer closer. at the lighthouse? Wait. I, 
I can't even believe this is real. This is happening because of me. Stop it. Just stop beating yourself up, okay? We've both paid our dues already on that. God, look at that. Look at that monster. Who knows? This could be Rachel's revenge. Our revenge. The lighthouse is out of the way of the tornado. Come on! Chloe... I've got your back, Rex. Whoa! Alfred Hitch Hitchcock famously called film Little Pieces of Time. I'm but back in class. As he what the hell? Films. These pieces of time okay, frame what the us hell? in our glory and our I have sorrow. to listen to this Jefferson lecture again. To shadow, this to might color, be hell. To cure now, can you give me an example of a photographer okay, who perfectly this captured is the messed human up. condition in black and white? A am I stuck in a time loop? Anybody? Imagine if that that's Pure. actually... Diane Arbus. Be calm and there you go, don't Gloria. freak out. Why Arbus? Yet. Because of her images of hopeless faces. I feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those Whoa. sad She saw humanity as tortured, right? What's going on? And frankly, it's bullshit. Nobody even cares? <laughs> we can rewind. There you go. Yeah, we get to see it again. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. I feel like totally haunted by the eyes Are of those like birds or something? She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. <laughs> Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. Uh, Everybody's gone now. Have I totally fucked up time? This doesn't make sense. Time is now meaningless. It has taken an ephem... ephem... Uh, shit, I, I messed it up. An ephemeral... Uh, is that a... Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, my brain, my brain, it hurts. You didn't die, Kate. You're alive. Not yet, you bastard. It means you're dead, <laughs> Mr. Jefferson. What is this? It's still the same, though. Still Rachel Amber. Okay. Holy shit. Look at all these dead birds. Oh, fuck. Uh, this can't be real. You can't handle the truth. You can. <laughs> we. I wonder if it, anything else has I changed. Ah. Any of this. Interesting. Interesting. Oh, no. Not as interesting. Um, okay. No matter what this would say. I'm not going to take the bait. <laughs> I'm not. I see you, Max Caulfield. Ooh, he's Don't back. even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Kick him in the balls. Is your hallucination anyway? I just wanted to know if you'd like to spend the rest of your life in my dark room. Your purity inspires me so much. And we would be so happy together. Dude. Who needs selfies when I can give you portraiture? I love no way, you, I Mr. Jefferson. No way. <laughs> which okay, which which is the most fucked up? Uh, our dark room. Hmm, I love you, Mr. Jefferson. My selfies are shit. That's weak. Thank you for killing Chloe. Nah. Our dark room. I think I'm going with that. I like to think of it as our dark, our dark room. room. It's the only place I truly feel safe and protected from the storm. Of course, Max. I can capture you over and over. You can be my model for life. And death. We are going to be so happy together in the dark. Just make sure you stay pure. I won't like it if you get dirty like Rachel or Chloe. Jesus Christ. Oh, he's gone. This can't be real. I don't believe it. <laughs> I didn't believe it. Oh no. Okay. It's the same. Let's try to get out of here. I 
I'm inclined to end things here. Or wait, maybe I should end it at yeah. Okay, you know what? I'll end it. I'll end it. If it turns out this doesn't take that long to end, I will I will just keep going. But if not, I'll add an outro when I wake up in the, in the classroom. Okay? Yeah, let's do that. But 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 before that, let's let's just do this. Yeah. So I think I'm going to end this here. I've I've progressed a bit from where we were before, but okay, that doesn't work. Wait, I need I need to end the recording. That's what I need to do. Now wait, I can just cut it and use it there. Yeah, yeah. So I think I'm going to end it here. We've I've kind of progressed a bit. Uh, the dialogues that happens, the events that happens in the classroom. But uh, considering that it's like past 40 minutes already, I think I want to end it here. But so anyway, interesting stuff. We what what did we do? We saved Chloe. That's what we did, right? We braved through the storm, met up with Chloe, and and then we pass out again. Yeah, it's interesting that we got to meet. Warren again, you get to save some people, even though I find that to be a bit meh, sort of. But yeah, I remember the line from Warren that you need to make the right decision at the right time. It's um it's going to mean something. Yeah. Anyway, if you uh oh, and we jumped through the photo, met up with Chloe, explained everything. I was I was suspecting that telling her about William would, you know, alarm her, would make her upset, but turns out it's fine. Although I guess it kind of helps in a grand scheme of things to convince her that we've been through hell and back again for her. But anyway, okay. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, leave a comment down below, and ring the notification bell icon so that every time I upload a video, it goes directly to your feed. Links to my social in the end card in the description below. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.